Hello everyone and welcome to Kindergarten with Miss J. I'm your teacher Miss J and if this is not your first time then welcome back. As always it makes my day that much brighter by just you being here so thank you for coming to this channel today. For today's lesson the worksheet is down below for the letter and the letter craft. So if you don't have a printer that's okay just recreate it at home the best way that you can. For more worksheets, I have a Patreon page with worksheets like this that have just some more detail and more fun and games. So that's an option if you go to the link down below. We have live story time, private chat groups, private tutoring, and over 100 resources. I also have a Facebook page, so please do check that out and like my Facebook page for discounts on some of the resources, as well as I will announce when there will be a free live story time meetup, and I would love, love, love you all to come. You can ask me questions, listen to the story, and it will be just a great time. So please like me on Facebook. Okay, we are ready to start with today's video. It's going to be a little bit shorter, I think, because our Explore, Make, Do is actually just going to be happening while we're here. So you'll find out what that is when we do our letter hunt. Now, before we get started, my dear ones, I wanted to say hello to some of my special friends at home that I know are working so hard, like all of you. So let me look a little bit closer and see who's there. Oh, I see Emily. Emily, hello. Thank you for coming today. And Caleb. Caleb, always working so hard. Hi, Caleb. And who else? Oh, beautiful Brinley. Hello, Brinley. Nice to see you. And oh, I see Nora. Hi, Nora. Nora sent in this wonderful photo of her working so hard on the letter S craft. Thank you, Nora, you did such a great job. And who else is there? Oh, is that Audrey and Scarlett? Hello, girls, nice to see you too. Thank you for coming today. And, oh, I see Silas. Hello, Silas. All right, my friends, I would love to see more of you. Please do email me the pictures that of work that you're doing, and I would love to give you a little shout out here on the channel, so please do send that in. I know you're all working so hard, so thank you so, so much. Let's get started. Okay, everyone, let's start with our quote of the day. Today's quote is, try to be the rainbow in somebody's cloud. Now, this is from Maya Angelou, and it's such a wonderful quote to think about because we've all had really rough days where we maybe feel a little bit sad, or upset and sometimes we just need a hug or a smile. So if you see somebody that's having a rough day and they're a little bit cloudy, you can be that rainbow for them. Maybe just give them a smile and say hello or ask them to play with you. All of those things help to bring rainbows to people's cloudy days. And I know my friends at home will do their best to be the best rainbow they can be. All right, let's get started with our letter of the day. Today's letter is P. Say it with me, everyone. P. P. Very good. There's our little P. Okay, let's take a closer look at the upper and lowercase P. Okay, this is the uppercase P. And I'll give you a little hint. The lowercase p is exactly the same. But when we do our letter writing, you'll see how they're different. All right, this is the uppercase p. We've got a line and a hump at the top. Okay, great. Now let's look at our lowercase p. It looks the same, doesn't it? We've got a line and a hump at the top. But you'll see that one of them is tall. Remember, Uppercase is the big letter and lowercase is the small letter. So we'll look at that a little bit closer. Now, let's do our ABC song. And Miss J forgot her microphone, but I am thinking on the spot and I'm on a beach and I found 
a piece of driftwood that looks pretty much like a microphone, doesn't it? Oh, pretty much. Okay, so I want you to sing nice and loud for me your ABC song, and I want you to pose, strike a pose when we get to the letter P. Okay, are you ready? Any pose you want. Okay, let's sing. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P. <gasps> pose! Did you pose? <laughs> Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y and Z or Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? Great job, and I loved your poses. Very good. <laughs> All right, let's move on. All right, everyone, it is time to go on our letter hunt. And today's message will let you know why I'm at this different location today. So let's have a look. All right, let's read our message. Today we will play at our picnic and make a pig craft. Have you had a picnic before? Well, that is where I am today. I can't wait to show it to you, but let's search for our letter P's first. Ready? There aren't many in this message, so it won't take too long. Okay, let's do it. Today we will play. Oh, I see a P. Did you see that one? Make sure you point to it when you see it. At our picnic. I see another one right there and make a pig another one craft did you see all of those <laughs> great job remember everyone that this is a letter and when the letters are squished together they make a word and when we have lots of words with a finger space in between that makes a sentence and we finish our sentences with punctuation. And we'll talk about punctuation at our next lesson, which is our review day. So I can't wait to talk to you about that. But let's count our letter P's. Are you ready? Count with me. One, two, three. <laughs> three P's, that's all. Great job, everybody. All right, everyone, it is time to do our letter sound. But I wanna set up our picnic space first, so. Let's get that set up and then you can help me find out what the letter P sound makes with things that I have at our picnic. Let's do it! Okay everyone, let's look and see what we have that starts with the P sound. All right, I have my plate all ready. I've got my juicy peach. Remember, listen for all the sounds. I've got a pear here that will be very tasty. This meal is very random, by the way, but <laughs> I think that we do eat these things at a picnic. Uh, I've got some peppers. These are mini peppers. I have some pickles. Mmm, I need a bite right now. Mmm, those are so good. <laughs> and I made some potato salad. Potato salad. Mmm. I'll have a bite of this too, I think. Oh. Mmm. <laughs> oh. And my daughter's. Who's that? This is Mr. Pineapple. Hmm. All right, do you think you know what sound P makes? Let's watch a few more of these clips and see 
if you know what the sound is, say the word out loud, and when we come back, I want to see if you know what sound does P make. Good luck. Okay, do you think you know the sound that P makes? Okay, when I say three, I want you to say the sound out loud. Are you ready? One, two, three. I heard it. You got it right. I heard some of you say that sound. Great job. The sound is p, p, p. Can you do it with me? P, p, p. Very good. And we don't want to say p. That's not the sound. It's very short sound. Very good. So let's look at our letter card then. We've got P, P, Pen. Say it with me. P, P, Pen. Very good. Great job, everyone. Oh. <laughs> While we're on the beach, I thought this is a great time to do a little body break. So everybody stand up with me and we're going to do something that starts with the P sound and that is a, do you think you know what exercise starts with the P sound? It's a push up. Can you do push ups? Okay, I can sort of do them but I'm going to try my best and because the letter P is number 16 in the alphabet, Miss J is going to try to do 16 push ups. I'm going to try. Okay. Are you ready? Do them with me. So let's stand up, find a good spot, maybe better than on a pebble beach, because it's probably going to hurt my hands. Let's give it a try. Are you ready? 16. Okay. <laughs> okay, count with me. One, <laughs> two, three, four, five, six, seven. <gasps> Eight, nine, ten. Now six more. Let's count to six. Ready? One, two. I'm not going all the way down. <laughs> Three, four, five, six. I did it. Sixteen push-ups. Great work, everybody. Okay everyone, it is time to practice writing our letter. And I thought that since I'm on this beach and I have lots of big logs here, I'm going to use them as my table. So let's do our writing on the log. Alright, let's get started with our uppercase P. So like all our uppercase, we're going to start in the sky and we're going to go down to the bottom of the grass, but not into the dirt. And then you're going to make a big hump that takes up the whole sky. Okay, let's try that again. So sky grass and then hum just up in the sky. Okay, very good. Now you can keep practicing those as you go across, but we'll get into the lowercase p and it's exactly the same thing. So, but we start in the grass and we go down into the dirt for our first time. So. From the grass, you're going to go down into the dirt and you're going to make your little hump, but it stays in the grass, like that. And grass, dirt, and make your little hump stay in the grass, like that. So I'll show you when they're next to each other how they're the same but different. So there's our uppercase P and our lowercase P looks exactly the same but it goes down into the dirt and the hump is in the grass. You see the difference? But they look exactly the same. One is tall and one goes low. He likes to hang low. Okay? So keep practicing those and we will move on everybody. All right, my dear ones, it is time to do our letter craft. Okay, here is my P and look I made a striped P which means we'll have a striped 
pig. Can you believe it? So <laughs> decorate your pee any way you like. I did pink stripes on mine and then glue it down to your paper. Okay, and then I added my ears and my nose, which I also colored pink for this one. So glue those down next. Oh, and look how cute this little guy looks. Okay, I glued on the eyes and the tail, and now I've got a real live piggy for the letter P. So cute. Okay, everyone, show me your letter craft. I want to see those cute little piggies. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're so cute. Thank you so much for doing that. Remember that you can post this in our Discord chat group through Patreon. I would love to see your work. And if you really want to, you can email me as well. I'd love to see what you're working on. So here's my little piggy. Now let's add our letters. Now we know how to write them. Let's decorate our letter craft with all of our P's, okay? So remember, we go down and we make a hump like that. And our lowercase is lower down. So start it at the bottom of the hump and go a little bit lower. See that? And make your hump. All right, let's decorate our paper. There we go, everyone. Great work. Now, my dear ones, you're going to write your words on there that we did. All of those words are down below. If you know more words, please do add them to your little pig and grown-ups. You can do the writing if you like. Your child can copy it down or alternatively, they can draw pictures for all the P words and that is totally fine. I can't wait to see what you do. Great job, everyone. It is that time. We are all finished and I'm so proud of you. You worked so hard today. Thank you so, so much for being here. Now, we don't have an explore make do because, well, the picnic was the whole time. But I do have a special other P thing I want to do that's for science and that is planting a seed. But I'll do a separate video for that. So stay tuned. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss those videos. And again, please do check out all of the links below. I also have a couple of other YouTube videos that I love to practice letters that is singing and dancing. So those are down below as well. So please do check those out. All right, everyone, I'm going to enjoy this picnic with my family tonight. And I hope that you get a chance to go on a picnic with yours. If you do, I would love to see pictures of it and see how many pea foods you can bring to your picnic. That would be great as well. So let's finish our lesson the way we always do with our affirmations. So repeat after me. I am kind. I am smart. I am important. Great job, everybody. You are so important to me. And every time you show up here makes me so happy. So thank you, thank you, thank you for coming today. As always, you have all my love and I cannot wait to see you next time. Have the greatest day and we'll see you then. Bye-bye.